How's it going ladies and bruises, I'm Bobby Six, and welcome back to Yakuza 0. Now as I said last time, we gotta go back and do some more pocket circuit racing because we're having so much- Oh! Having so much fun with it! Fighter, you came back! Alright! It's Fighter! Fighter's back! I just had to take a bathroom break. Sorry to keep you waiting. You took your time in there, Fighter! I had a particularly hard poo to get out. Yeah, friendship! Making friends with the nerds now. And soon I'm a nerd, that makes sense, really. Ah, not outside, I need to be in there. For pocket circuit racing stuff. That's where all the pocket circuit racing stuff happens. Oh, now what? There's always drama going on at the pocket circuit stadium. She's too fast! None of us even came close. I see why she's called the pocket circuit ace. Ranked third in Camarocho. Three elites are hardcore. Are they kids too? Is there no one else here? But they are kids. Pooey. I would have liked to race someone better. Oh god, we are fucked. What's going on here? You guys all lost? Kazuma kun! Yeah, we're all beaten pretty bad. This girl's way too fast for us. But maybe, maybe Kazuma kun can win. He beat my dad. I mean, he even beat Satoru kun. Oh, hello, sir. We meet for the first time. Are you a pocket circuit racer, perchance? Oh uh, yeah? Do you take these all these guys down? Yes, I did. My name is Cena. Please address me as Cena-chan, if you will. This girl's pretty snooty for her age. But she must be one of those three elite races Satoru-kun mentioned. Are you Kazuma-kun by any chance? Some other children were talking about an adult racer who isn't a complete dawdler. Uh. Yeah, I'm Kazuma. My, how interesting. May I challenge you to a race? Kazuma-kun, you gotta take it down for us. Don't let her walk away a winner. You can win, Kazuma-kun, please. Kids are putting all their hopes and dreams on me. Do I rise to the pocket circuit aces challenge? Challenge accepted. Fine. Challenge accepted. I was hoping for a race against someone fast. I would be taking it easy on you, Ace. I should hope not. Rest assured, I will not restrain myself either. My victory shall be the picture of elegance. She is kind of a cock, eh? Hey? Oh, same track. Well, that's good. My car's already built for this track. Having said that, I had some serious trouble with the with the uh, hill climbing. I might go back to the super regular gears. I know it's gonna make us slower. But we need to work on those hill- on that hill climbing, man. Alright, I think we're good. Well, hang on, hang on. What about the god speed motor? What does that look like? Oh, we got the god speed motor equipped. Okay. Okay, let's just go then. We're only rated at 28, but I think we can do this. Because we had trouble climbing that hill at the end there, last time. That's a cool car, man. Can we get a car like that? Is that the next one on the list? It's like a rocket. Here we go. Uh oh. She got more top speed than us, that could be a problem. We're upside down! Holy fuck, and I did not mean to push that button. Whoops! That all went so wrong so quickly. Whoa! Whoa! That was bad. She smoked me! I had high expectations for you. My goodness, so much for your sterling reputation. This is like a Kun, he's usually way faster. It's car trouble, it has to be. He'll just be as fast as always when he fixes his car. Is that so? No, I shall stay a while longer. Come see me when you're done fixing your machine. You may challenge me as often as you like. I'll be back when I'm done. Okay, okay. I fucked up. I have to admit, I fucked up there. I'm just gonna check the parts. I don't know, I, I did not mean to push boost when it was already upside down. That was a mistake. I have to admit, that was a mistake. Um. Super balance gears. 
A slight lean towards raw output. I really like the super balanced stuff, really. Super rubber frame. Lowers the chance of running off the track, but also slows you down on corners. See, that could be real good. And we got the super low profile tires. Well, there goes all our money again. It's going to be worthwhile when I wipe that smile off that bitch's face. That's not very nice. You don't talk about a small child like that. My bad. My bad. Alright, asshole. Time to go. Wait. Small child again. Fuck. Alright. Okay, I brought you back. Like, 19 attempts in. Now, I don't think we're going to win still. But we're going to attempt. And if we can't win it this time, I think we need to go and get more parts. Which I can't afford. So this is going to be our last attempt, and then we're going to go do something else until we've got enough money to come back. Because we are out of money. We might get lucky, who knows? Probably not, but it might happen. We're doing okay at the moment. But the same setup failed instantly last time. Yeah, it's over. It's over. I'm pretty sure we can't win this with the parts that we've got. And I just spent like 20 million yen at least here. So I'm going to go do something else. I've had enough. I'll come back when I'm rich again. Instead of upgrading my abilities like I should be doing. You fucking ass. Alright, anyway. Let's go do the main story thing or kill shit on the way to the main story thing. Let's go. <gasps> Mr. Shakedown! And I've got no fucking money. Hey, asshole! We can take him. I know we can take him. We've actually got healing items this time. Fuck, we can take him. We've never taken him before and we can. He's got six mil. Just gonna keep going until he wakes up. Or I'm gonna clear his bank account, one or the other. Wake up, asshole. Hey, you. You're the guy from before, the one who picks fights with innocent passers by. You heard about me. That makes it easier. I'm called Hiroya Igashiro. Oh, I remember we did this. Becoming the strongest creature. The strongest man in the world just doesn't cut it. One day I'm going to stand out as the apex of all organisms. It's awfully ambitious of someone who acts like a common thug. Why is the strongest living creature walking around town beating people up for money? Look, going to the gym or any of the regular stuff isn't enough for me. I need special training. And that costs money. How else am I supposed to pay for it? Everyone in Japan comes to spend money here in Camarocho. So here I am looking for easy pickings on the streets. Well, you better look elsewhere, because I don't feel like donating money to your cause. It's not a voluntary donation, I'm taking it by force. You won't have a single yen left when I'm done with you. Let's see about that, asshole. I've dealt with your kind before. Fuck you, man. I'm not gonna give up this time. You are going down! You are going down, bitch! You think you're gonna get the better of me? Okay, he's getting hyped now. Not that it matters. Shit, get up! Fuck! I had you! Holy crap, you did so much damage! What a fucking shithead! Oh, I had no money to take anyway, except what I took off him already. How is it I've never managed to beat that guy despite the fact that I know I can? I gotta admit, you're a tough one. So you get it? Your money is my money. I'll make better use of it anyhow. 64 grand. This is peanuts! I need real money to get strong. Looks like I have to keep doing this. Hold on, give me my money back. He's the real deal, I better stay out of his way while I'm carrying lots of cash on me. No way, I'm gonna fuck him up. Every time I see him, I fight him. Because I'm gonna beat him. I will beat him. I'm telling you that right fucking now. 
pricks only got. He's on borrowed time, that motherfucker. He is on borrowed fucking time. Hey, bitches! Which one of you bitches wants to dance? <laughs> Good, good. Slap! Better up! <laughs> Is that right, Morty? <laughs> Fuck it. That's what Mr. Fucking Mr. Shakedown did to me. He stomped me while I was down. How do you like it, shithead? Taking my taking my aggression out on someone weaker and less fucking physically able than myself. Just like Mr. Shakedown did to me. Hey dude, I'm back! I forgot about you all together. Hey Kiryukan. Maybe. It's the only one I can find in the whole town. Yeah, sorry, it took me three days. <laughs> Let's do it. あ。それじゃ、行くぞ。ああ。立花不動産のもんですかね。立花不動産。あとこれ。つまらないものですけど。おい、勝手に何すんだ。おい、勝手に何すんだ。あなた。何が立ち抜くの大変じゃないですか立ち抜くなんだよそれ俺は立ち抜く気なんかねえぞそうは言ってもねこのビルはもう山野井さんが新しいオーナーになったわけだからそれをあんたがいつまでも立ち抜いて
でけえ口叩くななんだとあんたごときにオーナーは出てこねえよバックのヤクザに伝えとけお前らの交渉相手はこの立花不動産だってなあんま調子に乗んなよ不動産や風情がそれじゃ要件は伝えましたよ辻さんま、最初はこんなところだな。<笑>ずいぶん荒っぽい交渉だったじゃねえか。ビジネスマナーって<笑>仕事ってのは使い分けが大事なんだよ。大体、あの辻って戦友やはうちの交渉相手じゃねえ。まずは本物の交渉相手を引きずり出さねえとな本物の交渉相手バックにいるヤクザかああ結局向こうも金が目当てなんだからよお互いぶっちゃけたあとはさっさと話し進めようってことなんだハロースピーキングヤクザ眠いねえ、キリュウ君。本物の交渉相手だろ。早速反応があったってことだ。おたくらが立場の不動産って人たち、山野井さんの代理だって聞いたあんたはおたくらの味方ですよ。杉田ビルの専用屋に困ってるんでしょ。ええ、まあね。私が話しつけてあげるよそしたら彼すぐに立ち退いてくれるからなるほどその仲介料としてうちはあんたらにいくら払えばいいんです話が早いねさすがカムロ町の不動産屋でそうだな、ね、700万ってところだあのビル転売したら奥は儲けが出るでしょう。七0なんて良心的だと思うね。ほんの少し部屋に座っただけで700万。あんたら楽して儲けすぎでしょう。楽して儲けてもお互い損だ。今時の不動産屋は濡れ手で合わない。だからってあんたらに払う金はないよ。ただ。それでもあんたらには専用屋に口聞いてもらうへえどうやってもちろん力ずくでだよねっキリュウ君おだあんた鼻からこういう筋書きだったのかまあでも新入社員の初仕事にしちゃ相手の数が多すぎたかいやそうでもなさい。せりわびやプロブレム。よけいなてまかけさせる。このてまちんも仲介料に上乗せするぞ。<笑>そのてまちんってのはいくらだ。三百万。合わせて一千万だ。Oh, he's angry. He's angry. Squatters, they're not squatters, they're Yakuza. Glasses off. So, it's a boy to cut a yo. 
お前らどこの組のもんだ登場会大平一家だ大平一家あいつの組か道島組若頭補佐阿波野ひろきうちを敵に回したこと後悔しても遅いからな首を洗って待ってやがれ Do I look worried? That guy's still. You're gonna take your friend? He's. Never mind. Oh, you're. せんゆうやらずしさんよはいまだその夜に居座るつもりならさっきの話の続きするかいいやそのあんたの後ろ盾は見ての通りだよ辻さんそれでもまだ一人で頑張る気 Okay, he actually was a squatter. Ah, so. So, then, tomorrow morning, I'm going to go to that room. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to go to that room. I don't know what this Kiryu is going to do. I'm going to go to that room tomorrow morning. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. See that you are. My good man. Ha, he runs funny. Ha, 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 ha. これがあんたの仕事のやり方ってわけか。俺のじゃない。全部立花社長から教わったやり方だよ。ま、最初の仕事にしては上出来か。どう。極道やり方。The same as your case of work。肩着の人間からも感謝されるしな。俺が極道になったのは仕事を楽しむためじゃねえさ。うん。お前もしかして殻の一つを手に入れたら極道に戻る気かそんな先のこと考えてねえよそっかそれよりこの後はどうするああ問題の戦友屋は追い出したお前は山の井のじいさんに報告頼むそれがそう天下一通りのセレナって店に来てくれここのすぐ近くだセレナ何の店だただの小さなクラブだよ安心しな今度は仕事じゃないささやかながら今日の打ち上げと行こうじゃないの俺のおもりだねえ、なきゃ、ポートリンクスヘイプス気前がいいんだなまあねその代わり山の井さんへの報告はお前一人で頼むわあのじいさんマイボールでボーリングするのが日課でねマッハボールに行けば会えるはずだマッハボールかなわかったそれじゃまた後でなマックボール Go to the bowling alley. Let's do it. Do it to it. Go. Sprint. That's a fucking dead end. Oh, sorry, dickhead. How many is that Mark Bowl? Just up ahead. Yeah, あれだけ圧力かけられてもまだ抗うとはまったくだしかし今回は体にみっちり教え込んでやったからないい加減次は落ちるだろう山の井さえいなくなれば
あのエリア一帯は娯楽王とまで呼ばれているシトラさんのものになったも同然ですからね<笑>まあそうなるなこれでファイブビリオネアの他の連中にもでかい顔ができるってもんレジャーキングファイブビリオネアもう人を殴る気分だねさっき殴り疲れちまったからねそれに俺って器が広いからよ見逃してやるよ兄ちゃん金持ち喧嘩せずって言うしな<笑>怖い顔した兄ちゃんだなじゃあねもう二度と俺の前に立つんじゃねえぞおい行こうぜは,はい Who the hell was that? There's a little pet killed him, the Leisure King, with a straight face They definitely mentioned Yamanoi though And I don't like what I heard I need to check up on him right away Fuck, they probably already knocked him out Knocked him the fuck out Better make sure he's alright キユさんお願いしていた仕事片付きましたかあ,ああそんなことより大丈夫か病院へ行くかい,いえ大丈夫です過ぎたビルまでよろしいですかわかった すみませんね。ありがとうございました。戦友屋の件も無事片付けてくれたみたいで。いや、それは別に構わん。それより大丈夫なのか。ええ、おかげさまで大した傷じゃないですよ。相手、相手、相手。しかし、一体どうしたという
奴らを狙いはあんた自身ではなくあんたの所有する物件ということかしかしなぜ連中はそんなに物件を欲しがるんだつまるところ金儲けですマネーゲームを楽しむためですよ現在の異常なまでの景気で物件や土地は転がせば転がすだけ金が儲かるまさにうちでの小槌です東洋一の歓楽街カムロ町の物件は特にね彼らはゲームで大いに力を発揮してくれるそんな優秀な駒を何としても手に入れたい物件を駒扱いかだがその駒には懸命に働いている奴らや平和に暮らしている奴らがいるわけだろうもちろんだが彼らは自分たちの儲けばかりを考えてそこで生きる人々やカモロ町という町のことを一切考えていない彼らのマネーゲームに巻き込まれて悲惨な目に遭っている人たちがすでに大勢いる私は何とかしてそれを食い止めたいこの異常な景気で日本は豊かになったように見えるだがいつかはこの景気の波にも終わりが来ると私は思っているその時カムロ町はこのままマネーゲームで引っかき回され続ければ雑草一本を生えない荒れ地になってしまいかねない、うん、私も長くこの町と共に生きてきた男カムロ町が大好きだだからこの町をそんなことにはさせたくないそのために抗ってきたんですがさすがにこの老体には荷が重すぎたようなもう限界ですかなそう言わずにもう少し頑張れないのかそんな奴らの金遊びのためにカムロ町を荒らされるなんてたまったもんじゃないぜもちろん私もカムロ町をあいつらから奪い返して昔の健全な状態に戻したいという思いはあるだが5ビリオネアには膨大な金があるし暴力に訴えかけることもできるこの老体にはそれがないくそなんとかならんもんなのかフフフつだけ方法がありますなんだそれはキリュウさんあなたが何あなたにはやつらに対抗できる腕力も悪いやつらを許さない正義感も揉め事を解決する力もある専用屋の剣も私が手に負えなかったところをあなたはすぐに解決してくれたそんなあなたがこの事務所を継いでくれればもしかしたら彼らに一矢報いてくれる何言ってんだ買いかぶりすぎだ俺には経営能力もなければ経験もない誰でも最初はそうです難しく考えないでいい私もあなたにお願いする以上できる限りの協力をさせてもらうつもりですご安心をそれにこの任務は不動産のいろはを学ぶ上でもきっといい経験になると思いますよ別に失敗しても構いませんどうせ遅かれ早かれこのまま行けばこの事務所は潰れてしまう運命だしかし別に俺じゃなくても他に適任そうなやつがいるんじゃないかなかなか桐生さんほどの男はいないと思うがねそれに私はあなたを信頼しているんですよあなたが思っている以上にねなぜだ桐生さんあなた風間慎太郎という男を知っているねえあなたは風間さんが経営する施設の出だそうですねつまり彼はあなたにとって育ての親だそして堂島組の若衆として杯を受けた今もその恩を忘れず風間慎太郎を親として慕い続けているあんた一体どうしてそれを誰か信頼できる人間はいないかと探す私に
あなたを推薦してくれたんですよ立花さんが立花ええくれぐれも内密にと念を押された上であなたのことをいろいろと話してくれましたということはつまりさっきの話は全部立花も承知の上ってことかええ立花さんもあなたがこの仕事を継ぐにふさわしい人物だと思っているんでしょうあんた風間のおやさんのことを知っているような口ぶりだからどういう関係なんだ<笑>昔ちょっとね詳しくは言えないが一つだけ言えるとしたら風間さんは私がこの世で最も信頼している男だということですそんな風間さんを慕う昔の彼にそっくりのギラギラとしたしかし綺麗な目をしている男になら私の全てを託してみてもいいかなと思いましてね、うん、お願いできませんか桐生さん今のカムロ町にはあなたのような男が必要なんです分かったそこまで言うなら勉強のつもりでやらせてもらおう失敗しても恨みっこなしたぜもちろん一つよろしくお願いしますよキリオさんはい、no time like the prison Let's get you up to speed on the basics of our business. But, hmm, it's a bit distracting with the place in such a shambles. I'll call my secretary to help straighten it up. Secretary? Didn't know you had one. Oh, yes. I'll introduce you later. She's quite the charmer, and I think you'll agree, Kurich san. So, I'm gonna ask you to step out for a bit while I get put the office together. Shouldn't take too long. Alright. I'm mean, always cleaning up his office. I should go for a stroll and then check back in later. But first, we need to wrap this episode up because we're way over time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you in the next one.